This is an exploded view of a typical window assembly. It consists of many parts, all individually tailored to suit the opening the window is to be fitted. Here we have our next project. I have quickly modelled a wall and taken the site server details to produce the openings for the new windows. Now all that is needed is for me to launch DriveWorks Express and enter the overall opening sizes and the customer requirements. Once Next is clicked, all the new components required to build the window are automatically generated in accordance with the rules put in place. For instance, a clearance is applied to the overall size of all the extrusions, seals, fascias and clips. And sections are adjusted to allow for the glazing thickness. All of these components then form the new assembly, along with any drawings that are required to manufacture the product. We can use DriveWorks Express over and over again, so I will jump straight into specifying the second larger arrangement on our building elevation. Once more, the rules dictate the outcome of all the parts, driving overall lengths, widths, section sizes, features and properties. The intermediate members are created or deleted in accordance with the number of window panes required. If a component has been generated previously, a rule can determine if it is to be reused and not regenerated, saving time. If a component contains configurations, rules can select which one to put into the assembly. Now my assemblies are complete, I can insert them into position on the building elevation, so I have an exact representation of my customer's requirements. All my new models have had a suitable convention applied to the file name, so they can easily be found and replaced into the assembly. I'm sure the time and effort taken to produce this detail will be appreciated, even though this and all the engineering detail has taken less than 3 minutes to produce.